So this new game called Bubblegum Mayhem released yesterday. It's brand new. Everyone has been talking about it. People are saying it's pretty good. So I decided to check it out and see what all the hype is. Plus, I needed something to play for my dying channel. But with all that being said, let's get started. Basically, it starts off like the old Bubblegum Mayhem. You know, we got infinite bubbles, no coins, no gems. We're starting off fresh. We have three times luck and a hatch speed event going on. So that's really good. But uh, we're just going to blow some bubbles until we can afford the first egg right here. The common egg. But let's check out the prizes. Prizes look normal. We got a ton of boost, which is cool. We got increased luck, faster egg catching, insane luck, three times tier chance. We got some codes. I don't know any, but I'm just going to get to release this one. It worked. We got 30 minutes of everything. That's great. Oh, and the index. Look at all these rarities. We got normal. We got shiny. We got chroma. We got void. We got glitch. We got golly. We got supernova. We got blaze. And we got shadow. Look at that. That is crazy. We have a limited egg. We got a few secret pets. But. And it looks like here we got some new rarity. I don't know. But super cool. We now get our first egg. So hopefully something good. And we got a normal doggy. By the way, all the assets have been remodeled. So the game's here to stay basically. Let's just go around the map and collect some coins. That's a faster way we can do this. 1.5, 16, 28. We can trouble latch too, nice. Trouble latch is free. Wait, actually I should have gotten a flavor. But our team's starting to look a little bit better. Oh never mind the stores coming soon let's see can we get to the first island or i'm positive we can make it to this first island there we go floating island just a sky chest here what it seems and we're gonna claim that and we got lots of coins nice we're gonna need those so we can get some ice eggs now uh, frost wool and a uh, piggy clear i can get something from it and Dark Dragon, not bad. Could've been worse. We're gonna get stronger now. And above all these portals here, you can see what they include. So that is really cool. So first island includes just a coin chest. The space island includes a gum shop and the eggs. The twilight, usual. Skylands has some stuff of its own, so that is really cool. And the void has some stuff as well. And it looks like we also got something over here. I wonder what this is. That's probably going to be for a future update. There we go. Whole thing is redesigned too. The gum store is a bit different. And same eggs. The molten egg. The lunar egg. I forgot the names. <laughs> those real quick. We're gonna get a fire gear and a magma doggy. Not the best. Just a little bit of. Oh, everything's just jam packed back here. I can just collect them. Found your secret hideout, boys. We can get a few more of these eggs now. Hopefully, something good. A fire piggy and. Nothing good. Then it takes so long. And look at all those gems. We're gonna be rich. I get as much as we can. We're just gonna gamble them all away on the infernal way. First try. That's our first legendary in the game, too. Third. Yes, we did. And one more, please. Yes. We got three. Not bad. We're now in the quadruple digits now. The Skyland. There we go. The gems here we can collect. But uh, this is a huge step up from the original BGS because it was just a chest, but now it's so much more. You got other islands with gems on them almost notably you got the release egg here with lots of pets we have enough gems to just buy one and we're gonna get a least doggy which looks really good 62 bubbles and it looks really classy just gonna claim the chest here and now we have five million gems we, that we can spend on this egg I'm not gonna argue with any of these, cause... Oh, we got something! Let's go! That's a tier 2 legendary too. A release serpent. And it has really good stats too. Same with these 
release dragons and release unicorns. We're doing 6,850 bubbles a click. But I'm gonna just spend the rest of my time. Okay, hopefully, you can get something good. Now. And there we go, the void. That's the gems we can collect here. But this design is really cool. Really cool. Eggs are the same as usual. There's a void chest here too. We got lots of gems. The pets here aren't as strong as like the release pets, so they aren't worth grinding for for you know the price. In which I'm going to hatch right now. But I will see you guys once I get all of the legendaries. Just got a release spider. That's the tier one legendary right there. Pretty good stats. All I see is just a slight change of colors. Kind of like an ordinary spider. Which only leaves us to get the tier three legendary here. With a 0.03% chance. We only have six minutes of luck left. Oh no. Hopefully we can get this before that runs out. Oh, and we already got that too. Let's go. Release Guardian. That gives 1.5k bubbles. So slightly stronger than the Release Serpent. And we all know the tier 3 legendaries are the coolest looking. I really like this. Super detailed. But I'd say we beat the game right there. This was actually really good. I enjoyed all the features this game had to offer. All the new pet variants, new boosts, new pets, rarities, everything. The redesigns looked awesome. Definitely one of the best beats this remakes I've played so far. And something really good to play while we still wait for Bubblegum Champion Jam, Bubblegum Mania, which will hopefully release later into August. And yeah, guys, that is going to be all for today. Thank you all for watching, and until then, I will see you in the next one.